This is another New Black World Order TV Productions. Uh -huh. Chopper, chopper. So we're talking about the word God and the word Allah. And why do Muslims insist and persist to call Allah God? So we're going to talk about the Christian um, Codex um, Argentus, right? And Bishop Ulyphus, right? This was originally written in the 4th century, but was prominently put forth in the 6th century, right? So we're talking about the German original language, the runes or the runic language. Runes, the word runes means secret or whisperer or whisper, right? So in the Quran, we're told that Shaitan is the one who whispers, right? So why are we dealing with, right, a word that is not rooted in um, the Quranic um, concept of a creator or a deity, right? And we have joined this on to Allah. So now the question becomes, is it shirk to call Allah God? Is it halal to call Allah Allah. Is illa illa. Why I continue to say. Because Bishop Ulyphus. Who wanted to make. A Hebrewic and a Christian text. Widely um, known. And accepted in the German culture. So he had to take. Uh, um, words. Right from the runes. Or letters from the runes. And mix them with other letters. And create a language for this. Codex. So my question is to the nation of Islam, the Sunni Muslim, the Shiite Muslim, the 5% of, um, the Ahmadiyya movement, or any one of them. How could you understand the 6th century Christian Codex Argenis that was originally uh, uh, published in the 4th century, right? Um, and a lot of you uh, modern Christians maybe don't understand the controversy that was going on with Bishop Ulyphus in the Aryan controversy, right? Does Bishop Ulyphus believe in Christ the way you do? Does he believe something quite different, right? That's your homework, right? Because we're talking about why do Muslims say Allah is God? Is the word God rooted in the German language or is it rooted in the Arabic language? That's the question. Is it haram to attach something that is rooted outside of the Quranic concept of a deity to Allah? Is Allah God? Is God Allah? Is God in his origins in the German culture and beliefs uh, the same thing that they're saying in the Arabic culture? I don't think so. So again, it's my contention, right, that we must trust information but verify it. You Muslims are also told about Dajjal, right, how he would create a, 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 a bidder, an innovation. And this is truly what this is. Allah could not possibly be the God of the Germans. And the God of the Germans could not be the Allah of the Quran. This is another New Black World Order TV Productions. Uh huh. Chopper, chopper. Runic. Runes. Mr. Ulyphus, right, definitely broke the laws, the Sharia of Islam by attaching God or God. Mentas to the deity Allah. This is another New Black World Order TV Productions. And as we always say, chopper, chopper, trust information, but verified.